Hello guys, in this video I'll continue talking about how to free disk space. For me, this has recently become a problem, so by some reason I see the message on my Ubuntu desktop that I'm run out of space. I already did some tricks, you probably saw it before in uh, my videos, I'll point it out. But right now I spot some different reason. Uh, so let me walk you through. You might consider actually putting the settings uh, yourself for your, as default settings for your desktop application. It might be different for a server application Ubuntu you might use, but for desktop I guess uh, it makes sense. So let me go through. Uh, first of all, I'm talking about journal uh, login. So in my case, what kind of problem I had was if I'm going there, CD journal, right? Uh, as you can see, there is something uh, in there. So basically, uh, this this is the location where Linux keeps keeps the login. So whatever happens in the system, different application are able to write to this log. And sometimes, let's say if there is some creepy stuff going on with application, it will be throwing more and more messages to the log. And like in my case, it was like a gigabytes of data there, right? And I was r running out of space. Let me just check some wild guess. So let's say ls min minus a. So let me just run this command. This is uh, this usage uh, with a depth of one. It will show me how much space it takes right now. You see it's like a 53 megabytes, which is uh, fine. But before it was uh, many gigabytes of data. Uh, to see what's going on inside of journal just with the proper command it's a journal control right so that's a command that you can use and see in real time what's going on in your system but what was happening in my system what kind of problem i had and you might have something like that as well i'll just copy it from somewhere test txt yeah, I'll just copy it here. I'm just sharing one screen. So uh, I had something like that. You see, pop OS org gnome nautilus blah blah vd pu c something mixer video mixer. As I discovered, the problem was actually with uh, my VLC player. Player was referring to some. Um, to some video file that didn't exist anymore, right? And because I kept it open, it was throwing more and more exceptions like that to the logs and I end up having like many gigabytes of uh, data in there. Let me just clean this. So how did I go about this, right? So the one of, of the way to handle this is just to, well, it just to remove the folder, right? You can simply remove uh, folder like that, right? R minus R M minus R F, and then just specify what you want to remove. Um, that's kind of easy solution, and there will no harm other than that you will just lose all your logs, which might be not what you want. But if you have a problem like that. I mean, if you already had like a gigabytes of data, then probably you can just remove everything after examining what's going on, right? After running this uh, journal control command, like I said before. Another thing what you can do is actually, uh, other than that, you can actually edit this file like this and go in there and put the system max use in my case i just put 100 megabytes so it will not exceed this this value which is good for me because i don't need that many logs in my system but for the server uh, let's say if you use a server machine then you might want to keep it like for one week or something like that in my case it's more than enough after you change this this value you have to restart your system daemon like with this comment right of course, you have to run it with sudo or put a password. So, hope this is helpful. Keep your logs short and enjoy the life, right? Okay, thank you.